Hello. Uh, so what I wanted to do in this screencast is briefly introduce you to MATLAB Online. So MATLAB Online is MATLAB in a web browser, uh, which can be incredibly fantastic if you are, say, using a tablet or Chromebook. It uh, gives you the ability to use the you know, full power latest version of MATLAB. Um, or if you find that during the semester you have computer issues and need to get a loaner, in which you can install MATLAB on, it gives you an alternative to you know, using MATLAB Online. Or if you just you know, like the idea of performing calculations in the cloud uh, as compared to on your computer, um, then it could also be an excellent solution for you. Or perhaps you want to get nerded out on a Friday night, you can use MATLAB Online uh, on your phone. Okay. So I won't go over how to create a MathWorks account, um, but you know, if you just go to MathWorks.com and um, you know, follow the links to create an account, uh, it should be pretty self-explanatory. Um, or, you know, if you have issues, MathWorks provides documentation. And so all I'm going to go to in my web browser is MathWorks.com. Okay. And so I already have an account. Uh, and so I'm going to log in. So I'm going to click the little person. Okay. And it already has my uh, email address and password uh, saved. Okay. And, and so my one note is when you create a MathWorks account, Stephen says here, I don't have a MathWorks account, account uh, create an account. Um, to make sure you use your uh, university um, or uh, whatever your affiliation is, make sure you use your work or um, you know, university email address. That way you make sure your account gets properly linked up with your license. All right, so here at Miami we have access to MATLAB Online um, and MATLAB Drive, and so you'd want to make sure that you have uh, access to that. And creating accounts is also going to be useful. So if you need to download additional apps, um, it'll allow you to do so. All right, so I just logged in, okay, and it brings me to my account page. Uh, there's my name and username. And I'm just going to click on the name um, or the link for MATLAB um, Online. Okay, and you'll notice Drive is there. It's on the online cloud storage, and you can also download software so you can access those files online. Uh, but then there's other resources too, like you know self-paced courses. I'm going to click MATLAB Online. Okay, and so this is. May of 2019, so MATLAB 2019 just came out, even though I only have 2018 on my computer, because uh, that's, well, I haven't uh, updated it yet. Um, and here you go, uh, MATLAB just opened up <laughs> in my Chrome web browser. Okay, And so everything you can do in MATLAB that we've already talked about, we can do here, all right, two plus two is four. Um, if I want to know about a sign, all right, help sign, you know, if I want to do doc sign, all right, it's all there. Okay, so everything we can do in our full version of MATLAB on our computer, um, we can do here without a problem. Okay, later on we'll see that we can create scripts and do all of those great things. Um, if I do a variable assignment, so assign uh, x or 5 to x, right here in my workspace, right, answer is 4. Well, that's because 2 plus 2 I didn't assign to. A variable so it got assigned to ANS by default. Here assigning 5 to X, all right, it shows up properly now in my workspace uh, right here. Okay. And you know that's about all there is to MATLAB online. Um, you know, I'll jump ahead to scripts. Um, so you know you can ignore this for now. If I, but if I were to create a script, okay, and um, we can just have our script be a variable assignment. So the one that we're going to create first in the next chapter is assign the variable 5 to x. Okay, and then I save this as. Okay, and I already created a my script. So I'm just going to call this my script 2. Okay, and so by default, okay, uh, this is saved in my MATLAB drive uh, folder. Uh, but if I want to, if I go back to home, um, you can. If I click on you know my script 2 I can download that M file okay bam here it opens up in my default text editor uh, on Ubuntu all right in the same sense if I've created M files uh, locally on my computer my local version of MATLAB right, it allows me the ability to upload them okay I can upload them up to my uh, MATLAB drive Okay. Again, uh, you know, MATLAB Drive does allow you to operate like uh, Dropbox. So I use Dropbox or Google Chrome, in which you can you know, have it automatically sync files uh, on your computer for you. 
uh, besides doing things manually like this. Okay, so that is MATLAB Online. MATLAB Online is pretty awesome. Um, for the purpose of this course, everything that we'll need to use in this course is available on MATLAB Online. Uh, and so, you know, if you'd like to, you can go ahead and, and give it a try. When we start to create files, you can download them without a problem. And so there's no issues with uh, turning in um, assignments. Okay, but uh, that's MATLAB Online.